Jonah Tali Lamu, the legendary New Zealand rugby union player, left an indelible mark on the sport during his life from May 12, 1975, to November 18, 2015. Widely recognized as rugby's first global superstar, Lamu's influence was profound. Standing at an imposing 6 feet 5 inches and weighing 119 kilograms, he possessed unparalleled speed, strength, and agility, particularly remarkable for a wing player, earning him the nickname, Freight Train in Ballet Shoes. In 1994, Lamu became the youngest ever All Black at 19 years and 45 days, accumulating 63 caps and scoring 37 tries in his international career. His defining moment came during the 1995 World Cup, where he astounded the world with a four-try performance against England in the semi-finals. Beyond his on-field brilliance, Lamu's contributions led to his induction into both the International Rugby Hall of Fame and the IRB Hall of Fame. Born to Tongan immigrants in Puko, Lamu's early life in South Auckland was marked by adversity and gang violence. However, his mother nurtured his sporting talent, and he excelled in athletics and rugby at Wesley College. Lamu faced health challenges when diagnosed with nephrotic syndrome in 1995, a genetic kidney disorder that affected his playing career. Despite adversity, he remained humble and used his fame to support charitable causes like UNICEF and Kidney Kids NZ. His sudden passing in 2015, at age 40, due to a heart attack linked to his kidney condition, resonated across the rugby world. Jonah Lamu's legacy endures as a symbol of resilience and talent, with tributes, including a haka and a national motion in the New Zealand Parliament, honouring his lasting impact on rugby and sports history.